The Iranians are not going to try to lob theater ballistic missiles at uh, Israel because the Israelis have said they would use a nuclear weapon. But Turkey is different. And the Turks have an unhappy record with the Israelis. Just a few years ago, they tried to deliver humanitarian aid to Gaza. The Israelis boarded their ship, killed some of their citizens, and turned back the aid. This kind of thing did not cultivate support and friendliness in Turkey. And remember, Mr. Erdogan is the de facto leading military power in the Sunni Muslim world. Finally, you have the Pakistanis who are very close to the Turks and have made it abundantly clear that the Turks will receive nuclear warheads and other capabilities from them if they need them in order to deter the Israelis from using a nuclear weapon. And finally, the Turks have the largest air forces and Uh, armies in the region. The Turks can put two million men in the field in the space of a little over a month. And the Turks are ferocious fighters. Now, all of this spells doom for the Israelis if they launch this attack on Gaza. What I've just described is an unwinnable fight. Even the air power from the United States that we could commit is not going to be.